So make sure you watch that entire interview with Karina on Cell Guru and keeping it in the Kapoor family. It's time to fly high with the Prince of Good Times, and we're sure that Deepika and Katrina will attest to that. Well, Rajneeti is shaped up already. Uh, uh, it's uh, it's a political thriller. It should be out, uh, I think, by fourth of June. Uh, so, looking forward to it. It's 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 a different genre. It's something which I really haven't uh, uh, you know done yet. I mean, I'm not done many films yet, but uh, even though the little films that I've done, but it seems interesting, and I hope that the audiences do like it. And I think all the credit has to go to Mr. Prakash, the director, because of his understanding of this medium, his understanding of politics and movie making, and blending that. So director Prakash Chha gets all the credit here, but a certain cat is not far away from the modest Ranbir's mind. Well, Katrina is amazing in the film, as, as you know, as much as the other actors in the secondary cast. But Katrina has really put in a lot of effort, a lot of hard work. She's got a great role, and I think she's performed it really effortlessly. With Rajneeti and Anjana and Jani wrapped up, Ranbir Kapoor will be making another trip to Delhi very soon. Yes, I haven't started shooting for that film. I start shooting for that film uh, sometime next month in Delhi itself. We have, I think, a 25 to 30 days schedule. So looking forward to that. There couldn't be a better candidate for this particular role, on screen or off. Ranbir's rocking, or is that rocketing? In New Delhi, with Shivani Radhika Vasti for NDTV.